Okay, um, hello air signs, how you doing? I hope everybody's doing well. All right, this is gonna be air sign reading, okay? So what's going on in you guys' energy? Okay, air signs. Again, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, energy reading. Um, like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. Join if you'd like to be a member. Um, new viewers, thank you for stopping by, checking out my channel. Subscribe. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. Sit back, enjoy the reading. I hope you can gain some insight that you want to hear, you guys. All right. Don't forget to check out my description box below. That fits benefits site. Whenever you get a chance, check it out. They have new items on the website. All right. If you're on a diet journey, especially check it out. All right. Um, they have meal plans. They have drink beverages um, for diet purposes. So check it out. Okay. If the website below doesn't want to go to my main page, click on the link to take you straight to that website. Okay. Whew, okay, you guys, what I was hearing for you guys, wow. Um, R. Kelly song, Step Step for the Name of Love. Step in the Name of Love. Yeah, that's what I'm hearing for you guys. Step to the right, step to the left, however it goes. Step in the name of love, however the song goes. But that's what I'm hearing for you guys. Um, Somebody's going to be stepping to you in the name of love. Somebody has fallen in love with you guys and somebody's getting stepped to. To the name of love. All right. This person, they're arrogant. They're very confident, but passive, very passive person. I was hearing flower boy. So this may be a type of person that loves to shower you with flowers. Okay. All right. Um... Oh, player energy as well. Maybe if you were dealing with this person in the past, they were a player. Okay. Hopefully, they're not still a player, but they're coming to you in the name of love. This person loves you. They're falling for you. Okay. They're in love with you. So they're stepping to you. So some of you going to find out somebody has fallen in love with you. Or that somebody actually lo loves you. You're going to find that out. Okay. And some of you going to be showered with some flowers. Or when this person, um, or they're already showering you with flowers. And, um, this is something to resonate with. The person showering you with flowers. Or they will be showering you with flowers, okay? All right. I heard flower boy. All right, so let's see. Let's get some cards to draw. Okay, air science energy, please. Air science energy, please. Thank you. Gemini Libra Aquarius energy. Gemini Libra Aquarius energy. Air science energy, please. Well, oh, these cards are flying. They may be coming into you pretty quick, real fast. These cards are flying. Or they're anxious. They're rushing. They're ready to rush into you. If they're not already coming into you, they may have already happened. This may have already happened. Because um, the Page of Cups is here. Pisces energy. The Nine of Swords is here. Gemini. Libra Aquarius energy. The Moon card is here. Cancer energy. Um, Three of Rods is here. Fire. Sag Leo Aries energy. The Ten of Rods is here. Fire, Sag Leo Aries energy. The Knight of Cups, Pisces. So strong Pisces here. Two of Swords is here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Okay, yeah, somebody's coming in with a phone call or a text message. You're going to find out that somebody cannot move forward without you that they're stuck on you they can't get you out of their head they're up at night worrying about you okay this person is depressed they're in a state of depression without you okay um cancer energy here 
something may be illuminated to you too, or there could be a secret. Be careful. There could be some secrets um, looming around this person or um, some secrets that they are, they have not um, revealed. They have not been revealed or it's something that needs to be illuminated to you. Okay. Three of rods. Okay. This person is, they have turned their back on a situation. All right. Because they're depressed without you. So they turn their back on a situation and they're waiting on you. Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, they're waiting on you. You're this person's fulfillment. Um, Ten of Rods is here. Yeah, they released the burden. They turned their back on something that was burdening to them or someone that was burdening to them. And they released that person so they could come to you and offer you love. What did I say? Somebody coming to you in the name of love. There you go right here. They're coming with this love. They're coming to express to you that they love you. All right? Um, two of Swords is here. This person may have used to be at a crossroad at, you know, how they felt, what they wanted, but they're no longer at a crossroad. They know they want to be with you now. So they released a burden. Okay? Yep. Fire energy here. Sag Leo Aries, Cancer energy, strong fire, strong Pisces. Coming with that cup in their hand. You their fulfillment. They're coming to express some love to you. Express how much they love you. Air signs. Gemini Libra Aquarius is energy. That one's up holding on to that. Yep. Six of Cups. They see you as their soulmate. This is somebody from your past. Okay. Could have been somebody your friend. Somebody you grew up with. Somebody you used to work with could have been some of you guys. Five of Cups. Okay, they miss you. They're no longer energy conflicted. This person could have been energy conflicted. They're no longer energy conflicted. They miss you. They may be in um, King of Cups. Yep, they're coming for some affections as well. Okay, they miss the affection that they used to get from you, whether it's mental or physical. They miss it. They miss the emotions, the affections. They're coming for it. The four swords is here. Hey, this person is wanting to heal things with you. They're praying for a healing. Um, this person could be healing themselves. But once they heal, yeah, this person, they could be going through some health issues or something. Four swords, and once they heal, or this could be you guys. Maybe you guys used to argue, got in an argument, and it messed things up between you guys. Some type of argument, and they're tired of arguing. They want to, they want to heal things with you. So they're in a rest period, praying on how to heal things, or to be able to heal things with you. Or this person could be healing themselves. It could be something health wise going on with this person. Ooh. If they're going through a health issue, once they heal, they're coming in with an offer. Once they get their answer from a prayer, praying for help, or, you know, how to come in to you, they're coming in with that offer. So you may be dealing with somebody that's not well, um, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. I see Scorpio Cancer energy. Okay. Mm, you could be dealing with a sibling. The Six of Cups. It could be a sibling. This could be a, a sibling as well. I don't know why I had to say that. But it could be somebody's sibling that you guys had a falling out. And they're coming to tell you that they love you. They want to heal things with you, you know? For some, it's, it's love, relationship, and some, it could be a sibling, a family member. Um... The hair font card is here.
this person has did some inner work to themselves. They had to do a lot of inner work to themselves. They, they went through a spiritual change. This person has grown spiritually towards energy. Yeah. They had did a lot of inner changing. You guys being apart from each other caused this person to make some changes within themselves because they miss you. And they know in order to get you back, they had to do some, some changing, you know, some work on themselves spiritually. They did a lot of praying. This person has gone through a transformation of sorts. Um, the Queen of Swords is here. Yeah, Aquarius energy. So you would let your guard down because you have your guard up with this person and they want you to let your guard down. So they know they had to go through a, a big spiritual change. This has this person, they miss you. They've been depressed without you. Okay, um, the King of Pentacles is here. Okay, um, this could be somebody you have stability with. King of Pentacles, Capricorn energy. So they want you to let your let your guard down. They they want the stability with you. You know, they don't want to lose. If you have stability with this person, they don't want to lose it. Or they want the stability back. Five of Pentacles is here. Oh, this person is lonely. Somebody could only want to be with somebody for stability reasons. So be careful. That could be what is deceptive up here. The secret. The deceptiveness. Okay. The stability. Because they don't want to lose. If, if you have stability with somebody... They may not want to lose the stability that they have with you, like money, finances, okay? They don't want to be going through a financial, you know, debt. So if you leave this person or if you, you know, they may be in a fear that you're going to leave them. Yep. The hangman is here. Yeah, they don't want to be in a financial drought, stuck financially. Pisces energy. The magician is here. Aries energy. Somebody's manifesting you guys. Aries. Ooh, they want marriage. The, the four of rods is here. There's an Aries coming in that wants marriage. Their, their, their intentions are to marry you. They're manifesting you physically. They could be doing love spells to um, get this marriage off the ground with you. <laughs> um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius' energy, please. That's for some of you guys. Yep, Ace of, Ace of Pentacles is here. This person wants, is manifesting a marriage to be able to marry and have a um, successful new beginning of stability with you. This person sees you as marriage material. This person could want to travel with you as well. There could be this per this person could be manifesting something where they want to travel with you, but they definitely want stability, a successful new beginning of stability with you. Some of you could have a successful new beginning of stability coming your way. Something new is coming about. Some type of success. You may have a business you're working on. It's going to be successful. Okay? Some of you could be wanting to buy a house. This is what this could be. New things are coming. Promotions. Okay? Something you manifested. It's coming. Something you manifested. This could be you guys manifesting. And it's coming to fruition. It's some type of success. So whatever you manifested is coming. It's going to be successful. Um, the Seven of Pentacles. It's going to lead you guys to have all kinds of options. Stability wise. Yeah. You may, be in a, you may have been in a state trying to figure out which way you was going to go stability wise. Manifesting whether you want it. Waiting on it. Praying on it. It's coming. It's here, you guys.
Two of Pentacles. Some of you guys may have been juggling stability. You no longer gonna have to juggle stability or juggling which way you was gonna go stability wide. No longer, it's coming. Yeah, you're gonna be charging for it successfully in your success. Stability wise, the chariot. Nine of Rods, no longer going through a struggle. One more card. Nine of Rods is here. Some of you guys may have to move. Okay, this may allow you guys to have to move at a distance for this success. You may have to travel back and forth for this type of success. Whatever's coming in successful wise for you guys. And it may have, some of you may have to move, but it's coming in fast and it's successful. You're going to charge for it very fast, successfully. All right. Okay. So like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. Join if you'd like to be a member of my channel. I hope I can help you guys. I hope this is something you guys wanted to hear. Congratulations. Beautiful reading, air sign. Okay. Like, share, hit the notification button. Subscribe. Be good. Until next time.